you know, the guy who chases the bus to get on the bus, to get to work on time, so he could work properly, to make a, a paycheck. And all of that is all propelled because of an inner will, because he wants to take care of his family. He wants to take care of his family. So, so too, for us, or so, so too is for God, rather, right? That's for us. Um, God has an inner will that propels an outer will. The inner will is the mitzvah, and here specifically Torah study, right? Because it creates that greater union. Right? It, Torah, mitzvahs are also the inner will of God. And here the reference point is Torah. So now that inner will produces an outer will. And what's that outer will? Creation. So when we're studying Torah, what we're actually doing, what we're actually doing is creating the inner will of God and therefore bringing a, a new light as a result to create an outer will that gives vitality to the world as a result. Now that vitality that's now, or the, that inner will that creates the vitality and gives a vitality to the world is caused by our Torah study. Hence, when you adopt a hostage, right, and do and study Torah for them, for example, in this, in this instance, right, you are um, bringing vitality to the world and bringing a merit to them. And uh, that vitality is all encompassing. It can't be enclosed in the world because it's too powerful. But that level is clothed within us and revealed in our soul when we study Torah. Ah, you don't experience it? Okay, that's true, we don't experience it. But the fact is, the union is there. The higher worlds, they get a glimmer of that. But in us, um, it's encompassing our soul. It's encompassing, it's, it's enclosed in our soul that divine will and divine wisdom of God in our study of Torah. It's affecting the entire world at the same time. Not in a way that it encompasses it, but it does bring an effect to the world. And hence, our Torah study helps the situation that's going on in Israel, helping our people, and helping all in a good way, in a healthy way, because it brings vitality through it to the world. Vitality to the world is the outer will of God. The inner will, the will of God is his Torah, because it's a part of him. It's his wisdom, his will. And therefore, when we study it, we touch that, elicit that from God, and therefore brings life to the world and brings us a, a divine connection that there's nothing like that, a divine unity that there's nothing like it, as in Torah study. That's it for today. I'm Rabbi Ronnie Fine, coming to you from Chabad Zuch in Kadesh in Montreal, Canada, where it's a privilege and a pleasure to share with you the Tanya. Unfortunately, there will not be Rambam today. Okay. Have a great day. Thank you for joining us.